Okay, like I said previously, it's like freaking 95 or something. A little breeze, so it's not killer or anything, but uh, don't know how long, especially if this track keeps acting up. Anyway, I think this is weird but cool. So it's a VW with a big motor out the back. Chippy love. This does have some more age on it, so if somebody was racing that. Oh, he is not stable at all. He was all over the place. So, I guess that big weight of the motor in the back was not good. Okay, always like my vets. This is a, what they call a Copo in a oddly green color. Here's 57 Chevy chrome or gold or whatever. Okay, hopefully the Corvette will stay on the track. Now that 57 Chevy ain't messing around. He took him down, no problem. All right, 64 Galaxy against a Super Nat or something like that. Looks like it could be fast, we will see. Supernet did not stay on the track. All right, this guy's all jammed up, so we're not racing him. Here's a cool little thing, Fangula. Kind of a custom, almost like a George Barris custom. Oh, George Barris, Batmobile, slot wheel. We'll see. Batmobile all day long. All right, he's on the track, but the Fangula. I forgot what this is called. Some weird name. We're gonna call it the purple. It's a Lamborghini SUV. Somebody's got some bucks invested in that. I only have one, but. Ambo was taking it. I mean, I don't know, it's pretty head to head, so. But then somebody was in the track. I have to call it a draw at that. Okay. I always thought this was kind of goofy looking, but since it came in a bag with the rest of them, and then I did buy this one because I just like 442s. And. Sometimes messes with the tray. Yeah, 442 all day long. There was, I had his brakes on or something in that little yellow ugly thing. 